वेरी वॉम वेलकम टू यू एंड वी एट बिट सुल इंडिया विश दैट यू आर डूइंग सेफ एंड हेल्दी अ वेक अप कॉल जस्ट बिफोर टेन मिनट्स ऑफ योर मोस्ट इंपॉर्टेंट मीटिंग अ फॉर्मल शर्ट टग्ड इन टू योर शॉर्ट्स अ पाम फुल ऑफ वॉटर टू ग्रूम योर सेल्फ फॉर द एंटायर डे एंड अ बोल फुल ऑफ वराइटी ऑफ नमकीन इज द न्यू वर्किंग स्टाइल फॉर मोस्ट ऑफ अस टूडे एंड ऑल थैंक्स टू वन कॉन्सेप्ट विच हैज फोर्स नॉट जस्ट इंडिया but the entire globe to follow it is none other than wfh that is work from home a new work culture which is not just trending but also has become a necessity for all do you remember those advertisements which stated earn six figure income by working from home or maybe earn by staying back at home those advertisements sounded like a hoax jobs and if at all anyone was doing work from home they were seen as doing a low key job that was the standard of work from home but since the strike of this pandemic situation today doesn't matter if you're a ceo of a giant corporate house or you are at the first step of the corporate ladder both have to work from home now suddenly this low key seen job is seen as a necessity and major corporate houses are run by sitting on a couch at home having said that many employers have been taking advantage of the current situation and have decided that some percent of the employee strength shall be working from home forever very obvious is allowing them to save a paisa on a rupee earned this might be going fine with the employers but not with the employees The recent reports have shown that employees are mentally and technically not prepared to work from home. Despite of all this, the employers are pushing them to be more productive and efficient. This begs a question: Is work from home really a boon or a bane? And so to go on a journey of a boon and a bane, I have with me our very own chairman of Bitsol India. Mr Venkat Venkata Chalam Hello sir hope you are having a good time working from your home office and with that let me jump to the first question of this episode What do you think of work from home as a concept As uh, concepts grow go is one of the uh, uh, best concepts when it comes to working Uh, and uh, my personal opinion is that you know it's a great concept you save a lot of time efficiency is the key you don't uh, you don't have to travel and particularly in metro cities it becomes a major issue and then you are wasting uh, productive time for unproductive work so elimination of uh, commutation uh, commuting time that's one of the major advantages then there is another thing which uh, uh, the reason why people uh, fall in love with um, work from home is that you know there is a it uh, it's supposed to bring in an element of work life balance something all of us uh, fight all the time during our uh, uh, career in offices at home so from a work life pol- uh, ba- balance point of view it is supposed to be a great idea then uh, there are but at the same time you could turn around and ask that no otherwise you know why is it that you know in india it is not so popular yeah there is a reason because our own work ethics are not that great to write home about the reason is that you know if we get a chance to sh- shortcut we will resort to it if we can avoid work we will definitely avoid work so that uh, work from home has almost become like a shirking work from home you go home whether you work or not is something which your your boss doesn't trust you and your colleagues don't believe you so naturally this has not taken off as it uh, ought to have been in uh, in india whereas the rest of the my, my world it has been a uh, uh, it has been a, 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 
it is being used and people are fairly happy about it so this is one uh, reason why it is uh, not so popular but uh, uh, once the, the uh, covid has come in things have changed now there is also another aspect to this work from home is that you know the employer employee feels i mean the employer thinks that the employee feel, should be feeling grateful that you know an obligation has been extended to the employee by allowing him to uh, uh, work from home so that you know is a kind of a favor to the employee whether it's a right or wrong it's another question so as a result even the employees employers are tending to become a uh, uh, little greedy in terms of extracting extra work for the, in return for the obligation in india is also been seen all around so this is by a large at my uh, take on the concept of uh, work from home i can find a uh, uh, fault with uh, uh, the concept as long as it works probably the problem is not with the concept or probably maybe with the executions here and there are you personally comfortable working from home absolutely comfortable and um, i can say that much because it is a personal question addressed to me i'm very comfortable because i am the master of my space and time and the surroundings so i decide as to when to start my work and how long should i work and from where i should work so i am i'm absolutely comfortable now unlike in the office you know there are no gate crashes people who come come in without appointment for, to meet you and there are no other disruptions or distractions except the ones you permit yourself so this is another advantage of uh, the show which i feel very comfortable because you know i am the master of my space now there is a considerable amount of uh, time uh, even for me even though my, my travel uh, my, uh, is quite limited so i don't i i do save time and effort in uh, either driving down to the office or be driven to the office you know that time anyway i save that every uh, minute saved is every minute earned now i have my own kingdom but uh, when i look out you know i have a greenery all around and uh, there is not i have no complaints so as far as i am concerned you know, because this is important as far as i am concerned i'm very comfortable working from home because i have got some privileged space you got to remember that you know not everyone is privileged to have this that is where the problem normally arises i i am comfortable because it is a personal question addressed to me yes i am comfortable and my work has not suffered in fact my productivity has in my own estimate has improved are you in favor of asking employees to work from home on a regular basis no but that's a qualified no the reason why i'm saying is is that there is a huge amount of sacrifice an employee is called upon to make and particularly if it is a lady the karma the sacrifice is that much that much higher now there is a domestic ecosystem for every household now you can imagine when you working from home for a lady when you look uh, uh, when you are asked to imagine it is something like this her uh, laptop through which you know she is communicating or she is um, uh, working on must be perched dangerously on the top of a washing machine which must be making it so noise and then must be uh, shaking and dancing uh, all the time when she is washing her um, uh, clothes and then she is cooking at the same time and she is multitasking and the children are screaming from uh, uh, elsewhere and uh, working from home for her i mean i'm not generalizing it 
but working from, for her from home is working from kitchen. That is an unfair expectation. This is one. Even for a man, when he works from home, the demands on the uh, domestic ecosystem is so high because there is a system, there is a kind of a balance we have, we acquire over a period of time with which, you know, there is a peace around the house. Who can talk when and then, you know, what, what kind of a this one, office separate, dom uh, domestic requirements uh, are separate and that kind of a system which gets disturbed. This is one. Then there is a, most of the people, a large number of people, except very few people like you and me, very few people have that kind of a, have that kind of the kind of a luxury of place and peace. I don't have, most of them don't have that kind of a place where they can carve out a corner exclusively for the office. After all, you know, they have to work, uh, 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 carve out a place within the existing space. Now, you uh, till yesterday, you had a separate office, you have a separate home. Today, your home becomes your office and office becomes your home. That's uh, 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 the uh, other uh, problem. Then you are uh, in the whole process, you're actually surrendering your uh, personal uh, uh, space with your personal space, that is, you know, geographical space within the house to the uh, uh, company, to your employer. That's an unfair thing to do. You don't even, normally, you don't even get a rent for this. As the employer feels that, you know, that he has done an obligation to you by allowing you to work from home. But then, actually, you are uh, giving a favor, you're doing a favor as an employee to the employer because you are uh, uh, you're giving that uh, uh, place you know where you work from rent free to the employer then there is a the, one of the most important things you know in this context in which I, the objection which i have is there is a it is a clear case of invasion of privacy now there is uh, uh, privacy in the sense you know you have no right no employer has a right to get into my house and then, you know, in a way, dictate uh, terms as to, uh, you know, by asking me to uh, my, uh, spare some uh, space for you as an employer. Now, another one of the biggest uh, things which uh, my office uh, serves is the kind of uh, infrastructural support it gives. The technological challenges are so high, so high. Individually, it is so difficult for people to uh, to uh, uh, get over this issue without the support of an office or of a company, which is the support of an organization. So this is a major uh, issue, technological support, which you would require, you know, your, uh, your computer, your laptop, your network. You know, most of the time the networks don't work. And we are in all that kind of a perfect system where we can comfortably sit uh, like in an office and work. In the office, in the office, there are people who take care of these issues. This is uh, the thing which I feel the reason why one should not ask, ask the employees to work from home as, uh, as far as possible. Because there are, uh, I, this uh, my answer com uh, comes to you with a caveat that, you know, there are, uh, there are employees who are happy working from home. I have no problem with that. But there are, uh, if there are, uh, Okay, okay. Another reason why people would now prefer to come home is that, you know, if I don't work from home, I don't earn my salary because of this pandemic. During this pandemic, this is an exceptional circumstance. What I am talking about is after looking at this now today, like some of the companies like uh, I think TCS or some company have already decided that, you know, 25 percent, 30 percent of their workforce will permanently work from uh, work from home. That is an unfair expectation. Uh, uh, from the employees. If, they, if Of course, if the employee decides that, oh, no, okay, I will work from home, welcome. You welcome aboard and you work from uh, office. It is so comfortable for both of us. I also save, you also save, and the company saves the bargain. Otherwise, if the employee is not uh, in a position to work for, from home comfortably and profitably, it is unfair to expect uh, 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 him or her to work from home. Uh, this is my take on that uh, my question.
do you think employees on their own would prefer to work from home and leading to that question i have another question do you feel work from home is going to be the future work culture of the emerging companies it depends this is a, a, a it depends you know first and foremost is that you know people are not used to working from home on a regular basis this is a disruptive kind of a, a event which has taken place because of the pandemic and now i am working uh, from home and i may as an employee may get used to working from home if that is the case i will say that okay i am willing to work from home give me a chance so this is a win win for both so but then my own guess is that you know some may agree to work from home but most may not no the uh, look at it you know uh, uh, first and foremost as i explained earlier is that there is something like a domestic balance now it is not only a question of work and uh, life balance you know house and uh, life balance now today by you know what are you what is your uh, when somebody asks you why are you working you working to make a home your dream of making a home but what are you in the process of working from home what are you trying to do you are actually wrecking my home in fact you know i wouldn't be surprised if uh, my, after all this pandemic and all the some survey or other will come out and say that you know the happiness uh, uh, the the uh, the divorce rates have uh, increased because of uh, working from home i wouldn't be surprised because too much of uh, proximity is not go- uh, good for your ma- uh, uh, marital health this is probably especially true in uh, places where there are limited space to work and uh, run a home so this is uh, my uh, uh, my uh, the my take on this domestic peace will be may become a casualty but then you know you look at it you know in a in a house normally i am saying because you know i am not talking about the privileged few like you but then i normally you will miss uh, your air conditioners you may not be able to put an air conditioner in, uh, at home but in the office you will have an air conditioner in the office when you uh, I ring the bell the pune comes with a cup of tea your husband won't do it or the wife or, or the country may not do it so these are all the privileges which you enjoy in the office which you will not be able to enjoy at home so these things do work by uh, 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 quite a bit uh, uh, while working on uh, 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 from home. Now, now today the, because of the pandemic, people are saying that you know it's a great place. You know, work is a great place uh, to uh, work from. Uh, home is a great place to uh, work from. But there is this uh, study. Uh, uh, you know, there is this uh, concept called Hawthorne effect. This Hawthorne effect. it is uh, i mean the psychologists have uh, proved that the people's uh, the people's behavior change when they are under observation today you and me are under observation because we are working from home people are watching us and seeing that you know are you working well is it uh, the new norm and are you going to be comfortable if the office is going to be redefined in the form of a house all these things are under observation so i my me and my work is under observation so i am i am subjected to this hawthorne effect this hawthorne effect says that you know when somebody is observing you in a short period of time you tend to work extra better and better efficiency and with the better productivity that is not uh, uh, extended beyond a short period of time so now today if you if somebody comes and tells you that you know i am having the best time in my work uh, work life because i am working from home take it with a pinch of salt hawthorne effect may be at work this is uh, this is my uh, my uh, answer to your question and to conclude what is your verdict work from home a boon or a bane yeah i have a few of uh, things on this uh, work from home because uh, if I, uh, i i work from home myself she when uh, uh, i mean I, when an emergency uh, was imposed the trains in india were working on time 
Indians never thought the uh, trains can run on time. It can happen in the Washington. It can happen in uh, Tokyo. It can't happen in uh, in any other cities in, uh, in India. But trains did were uh, ran, ran on time. That was something which was unbelievable. That was that was short lived. That kind of a euphoria was a short lived one because subsequently. It became an uh, emergency, wrecked your um, democracy itself. We have to wait and see whether work from home is indeed uh, the right prescription or it is going to wreck both your uh, my home and your office. I am not a blind votary for work from home. It may work, like I said, in the uh, my, like emergency. We let us wait and see whether it is really uh, 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 if we're going to uh, improve our productivity uh, across the board. Now, another thing which will happen is look at the effect of uh, this on the children. Children becomes the biggest casualty when the, uh, uh, work from home is there, uh, if particularly if uh, both the husband and wife are working. Now nobody has time to look after them. Then what do you do? You give them a, a iPhone or you give them a, a iPad or ask uh, the uh, children to sit in front of the uh, uh, TV screen. You expect them to watch serials that are not great ones. You expect them to watch it uh, throughout. And what are you doing in the bargain? Because you want peace when they are, when you're working. You are putting them onto a, a, a onto a, a side uh, rail, and ex all uh, uh, all the time till date, you have been trying to wean them away from uh, the screens, all kinds of screens, whether it is iPad or your iPhone or your uh, uh, computer or or your TV screen. You wanted to wean them away, and today you are putting them back onto the back in front of the uh, screen. And what is it that you know ultimately is going to achieve? You going to your children are going to become zombies. This is a kind of a this is the children in such cases are particularly even if it is only one of them is working because you don't want disturbances in the so because you would like to peacefully work in the at home. So if you don't want to create zombies, we may have to work in offices and not from home. And second, this one is you know this is one of my this one uh, my important uh, uh, I mean uh, strident criticism is this that this is a creeping invasion of my privacy as an employee. Now you can't expect me. You can you can't as an employer. You don't have the right to enter my drawing room and decide that you know I must work from there. And I must um, uh, uh, contribute to the company's profitability. I have no problem in uh, uh, working uh, better, working efficiently. But all these uh, uh, can be achieved uh, only when my house is separated from uh, uh, work. Even a, uh, 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 see that is why people even say that you no, know, there is a difference between home and house. Work from home is uh, something which uh, 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 technically, but for this, okay, I am not again uh, reminding you that you know this is uh, an extraordinary situation, and during this situation, I have no uh, this one to make because if you don't work, we are going to be uh, uh, to face a, uh, a worse crisis. So you know, I will let us take uh, my, uh, this away, this uh, pandemic away from uh, uh, the situation, and beyond that, unless and until. The person concerned is fully willing and wanting to do it. We should not try this uh, housework as a matter of uh, if, uh, office discipline. Yeah, it's only uh, it, it must be optional. Now another this one is there. You know, till date, you know, all these years, the HR honchos would tell you, you be engaged, come closer. We will have to work together. And today, what are you say, uh, saying? You, uh, some some people will work from home. Some people will from office. Some people will from somewhere else. What would happen to that engagement? How do you develop a team spirit 
through uh, the uh, through screen sharing that looks a little uh, odd to me so because uh, maybe that you know i belong to the old generation where i have been uh, been exposed to these kind of a situation but then engagement in reality will not take place if we are, if we are going to meet each other for work only in uh, uh, only on screen say that goes uh, for relationship building with customer relationship building with um, other uh, associates in the company there is no substitute to personal interaction and that cannot be uh, uh, cannot be and should not be compromised so this engagement bit is an extremely important component component of a uh, work uh, of work in teams in a, uh, in an organization so again i am not uh, blindly against uh, uh, working from home for some people it will be suitable is uh, very well for some people it may not be suitable there we should not insist on that so but then to say that you know working for home is the best thing to happen to industry i do not agree and i have serious reservations on uh, on this now to put it in a way as a concept i would say it has value but it is not part of my values you got it it has got value but it is not part of my values if you are uh, if you are okay with it fine i have no problem in fact if i were to work from home i have no problem i i will work from home but not everyone may be as privileged as i am so to that extent i would take it with a bucket full of salt when somebody says this is that is a, uh, the new norm and that's the best thing which can happen to industry work from home everything will be hunky dory from tomorrow this is my overall take on the subject of working from home but is definitely a bane for a large number overwhelmingly large number of people now you have as long as you invade their homes for your work an employer is, is not justified in uh, asking the uh, people to work from home but with the caveat that if the employee feels very comfortably like me that you know work from home is the best thing to happen yes by all means do it i am not saying that you know i am not putting a rule i am not saying that you know it is a boon or a bane but for for most people it would be a bane but some privileged few it will be a boon thank you sir for sharing uh, on uh, is work from home a boon or a bane now many of us for many of us it might happen that work from home might be a boon and for many it might be a bane these are the personal opinions and we don't want to discount anyone's personal opinion but considering current situation whatever the situation is out there doesn't matter if it's a boon or a bane we advise you to work from home because it's safe and it's necessity of this current situation on and that note it is now time for me to wrap this episode but you stay tuned as we are coming up with more such episodes with the experts this is your host rohan arote saying a very good bye until the next episode till then take care stay safe stay healthy and if possible work from home and if you're thinking of gst think of bitsol